Welcome back to Salty Reflections. We're out on the water of the Savannah River today. We're gonna take you guys out fishing. Got myself, my beautiful wife Steph, my three little granddaughters along for the ride, and got my son Daniel and Odie in another boat. And we're gonna go out here and see if we can catch some fish with these girls. See if we can put them on those brim, maybe a catfish. You know, just going out here to have a good day, right? Right. We got some pink worms. Gonna be fishing Carolina rigs on the bottom. Got a couple brim busters. What did you got? girls have already spotted an alligator right here and we're coming out of the little hell boat landing this is one of the lakes right off of uh, the savannah river we're going to take you guys out of uh... y'all ready to catch some fish yeah! i know i'm ready you ready stuff i'm ready I know my son back there, he's ready, and my little grandson. Thankful for another day. Thankful for a day to get out on the water. Yeah, I'm gonna show him. Emma. Emma's wanting y'all to see this butterfly on her pappy's hat. Huh. You think that butterfly loves pappy? Yeah. Do y'all love pappy? Yeah. Well, give me a big thumbs up. We're gonna have some fun today, girl. He's still on there. We're coming right out to the mouth of the Savannah River. We are on the South Carolina side of the Savannah River. And right on the other side is the Georgia side. The Savannah River is what separates South Carolina from Georgia. We're gonna go out on this river and find us a place to fish, guys. Yeah. 
It's the same one. We're gonna see who can catch the most fish today. Who do y'all think is gonna catch the biggest fish? Our boat or Daniel's boat? Ours? I hope so. I hope we catch one this big. That big? Well. If y'all see a good place to fish now, y'all tell me, okay? Harper, Harper, come back this way a little bit. Put your legs back down this way. Come on. And I'm up. Turn around. Put your legs back down this way. Guys, I like for them when they're riding along in the boat on the Savannah River or anywhere to keep their legs on this side of the seat because, you know, we can easily hit a sandbar or a log or something and their legs will just help grab a little bit to keep them, you know, them going out of the front of the boat. Man, I bet there's some fish right there. What y'all think? Y'all think we should find another spot? That butterfly, let me see. I ain't been able to see this butterfly yet. Wow. He might stay with me all day. I hope he stays there and brings us good luck. Lots of butterflies and dragonflies out here. with his dad the only one that we don't have with us today is little Chrisley she's still little and we left her at home mama's taking care of Chrisley today right yep but we give him mama a break and these girls they love coming fishing fishing and crabbing right We can't hardly hear you. She said, do you remember when the fish slapped her in the face? No, I don't remember that, not in particular, but I wouldn't doubt it. Pappy's got bad ears, he can't hardly hear. by the mud and dirt line on the limbs how high the river has been a week or so ago but it's dropped quite a bit pretty wildflowers these girls said they have found a good fishing spot yeah. Okay. 
some beautiful wildflowers. Last week when we were out here, we saw some hummingbirds. So we might see some this week out here. I hope so. Is that butterfly still on the top of his hat? Nope, yeah. he's gone now. He's gone. All right, let's show these guys. Oh, what he's right there. The day. He's right there on that leaf. I see him right there above you. So guys, this is what we're going to be fishing with today. These brim and stuff, we, we just need small tackle. Little size four eagle claw hooks. Real little small hooks. Little wire hooks also. We like to use the wire hooks because if you get hooked up on something, you can pull them and bend them out straight a lot of times. And got the trusty cup of pink worms. Just the pretty pink worms. Don't step on the fishing reels now. She wants to see. All right. Harper wants to see. We're gonna get the fishing guys. Y'all girls watch out for snakes up there. All right, this is a good fishing pole right here. This is a, what they call the little brim busters. We got it already rigged up with a little hook, a piece of split shot lead, a little weighted cork. And when I'm talking about a weighted cork, you can see that cork's got that lead right there on the bottom. Clips onto your line, got these little hooks on the top and the bottom. And I like these because they're, you know, they fold up, slide together. I know most of you know about these brim busters. This is a little 10 footer. And I got the weighted cork and I'm just going to add one little tiny piece of split shot right up from the hook about eight or 10 inches. Don't get on to me about using my teeth, Steph. All right, here we go, girl. Papa, I need to get past you, Hold on. Now, everybody can't come to the back. We got to stay spread out a little bit. Mimi, I'm done. Here we go. She wants me to get her trash. I'm going to throw it right over here. Uh, Look right over there. We've got it right in there. Fishing about two and a half foot deep. I don't hold it. Hold it. You want to hold it? Yeah. I want to hold it. Happy's going to get something for everybody to hold. Hold that right there. Okay. All right. You got to hold it right there and let it stay in the water. Okay. You can't pick it up out the water till you're picking the cork up. Like that? That's right. Well, when that goes under, that means you have a, date, um, a bite. That's right. If that cork goes under, that means you got a bite. You can pick it up and put it closer over there, angle your pole out that way. The tip of your rod, carry it that way. Emma, don't hold it between your legs. Let me hold it. This way? Let me hold it for a second. Let me hold it. Look. See, we want to get close to these bushes. That's where those fish hang out. And we might be able to leave it laying right like that right there until you see the cork go under. That? Hold that in. Hold the in. There you go. Let it sit right there. And we got some little Zupco 404s that we're going to be using Carolina rigs right on the bottom. Give him a second. He's got me trying the video. And take our saltaholics along. Oh, man. And you guys. The struggle is real, you guys. Video making ain't that easy. I know there's worms in here. But you got to keep it on though. And you can see guys what has happened from our last trip probably getting hung up. These little wire hooks, they get bent, getting hooked up on stuff. And you can pretty much grab them, straighten them back out. That's why we like using those little eagle claw wire hooks. I'm thinking we're going to catch something here real quick in a minute. I hope so. 
Daniel, y'all holler if y'all get a fish. I want to hear somebody say, we got a fish. Yeah, I want that one. Oh man, that's a good spot back there. I bet there's going to be a fish back there. Harper, we're going to leave this one sitting right here. Yeah. And the thing about fishing, guys, like this here, is you got to just get that pole in the water, get that bait in the water. Be patient. Let it sit there. Let the fish find the bait. Right, girls? Right. It takes a little while sometimes. We're going to get enough rods baited up that hopefully something comes along and bites one of these things. Uh-oh. How many of you guys ever get your grandkids and take them out fishing? They love it. Right? Yeah. And if we don't catch no fish, what will we do later on? What y'all want to do if we don't catch no fish? Uh, go to Walmart. Go to Walmart? <laughs> yeah. What you going to do at Walmart? Go candy. Well, how about... Get candy. How about if we don't catch no fish, we might go to a sandbar yeah. and swim. Yeah. Sandbar. Sure. Where do you want to put it at? Right down here? Yeah. I think that will be a good spot. It probably will. Alright, hold it right there, Olivia. Here, Olivia. Here, Olivia. Here, Olivia. Whoa. You want to hold the worm? Yeah. That's all you care about is show them the worm. You happy just to hold the worm, right, Harper? You don't care about catching no fish as long as you can hold the worm, right? Yeah. I bet when the fish gets in the boat, you'll want to hold a fish, won't you? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yep. I bet if we get a bite, somebody's going to want to reel it. I feel bad in it. And listen to the wildlife around us. You hear it? I don't hear anything. What is that making that noise like that? I think it's crickets. Crickets? We need some of them to fish with. What'd you do with your worm, Harper? Oh, you put it back already? Okay. Uh-oh. Was you getting a little nibble? You think they're under the boat? Yeah. Could be. Well, your line's down there kind of close, so if they're down there, they might get on yours. We might have to find a deeper spot, because... This spot right here, when I'm throwing out there along this bank, it don't seem to be but about two to two and a half foot deep. Maybe they're in a little deeper water. It's so hot right here in South Carolina right now. The fish might be in deeper holes trying to stay cool. Yeah. Harper, sit down, sit down. You can't stand up there. Hey, get your hands back in the boat. Harper, leave that alone. Somebody's got an old set line set up there. Let it go. Let it go. Where's the old set line? Don't put your hands out the boat. Where's the old set line? Let me get them straight, guys. Harper. 
He's a little busy body. That's right. Turn around, sit down on that core. Get up there. What? You want something to drink? Yeah. We just got here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. You move out of the way. Yeah. Let's drink this first. Okay. Let's drink this first and I'll give you some Kool-Aid next time, okay? Y'all going to keep your drink? Yeah. This is your top right here. I got your tops in the boat. We can put them back on. Yeah. Olivia, let's push yours out here in a little bit deeper water. Let Pappy hold it for you. Yeah, it's kind of shallow right yeah. now. I got it. See if they might be in that deeper spot. Hold it there. Put your rod down a little bit, like that. You can lay it right there. Now reel it up just a little bit. Keep it lying tight. Olivia's hooked up on a fish, you guys. Take it easy with him, Olivia. Oh yeah. I hope I don't get stuck. I hope you don't get stuck on the boat motor. You? Oh man, that's a nice little brim. Look at there. Man, man, man. Let you hold it. Yeah. Look at there. He swallowed that little hook too. Congratulations, Olivia. Hold it right there by her. There you go, Olivia. See the little brim? We're not going to let nobody hold it. Because Pappy ain't going to let you hold it. Hold your bait for a second. Good job, Olivia. You caught the first fish of the day. Where's our little fish stringer at? Do y'all see it laying in the boat? I don't see it laying in the boat. Oh, it's right there behind the... Yes, it's behind this little green container here. Stand up. No, you're not holding it. Because I'm gonna put him on the stringer. And you can't let him go like you let and the last stringer go. Fish right here. They're great to eat. We're gonna keep him. We're gonna run this little stringer right up through his gills out of his mouth. This little stringer has a ring on the end of it, and the first one we always put on the stringer, we loop it through like that right there. So he can't get away. And that's how we'll keep him alive. See him swimming right there. We'll tie him right here to the side of the boat. Uh, but what if um, one of the fishies eat it? Like a bass or something. She said, what if a bass eats it, Pappy? If a bass comes up and eat it? A bass? I guess we'll try to snatch him up real quick. What you think? No, let me see. We got the bass. At least we got one in the boat, you guys. Oh, we're on the stringer now. I just petted it. I want to try. Got something to keep them occupied. Little fish. <laughs> Off to try another spot. Got that one little brim out of that hole. We got to find some shade for these girls. You and hot? For us also. Hot. Well, Daniel's done moved a couple times too, so they haven't had any luck. Guys, you can see Daniel and Odie, they're across the river from us now. They've already changed spot two times. I don't think they've had any luck yet. <laughs> oh, 
This is where all the fish live, Olivia? You think? Yeah, this is where my daddy catched the big, um, um, Any luck yet? catfish over there. No luck yet! We, we got, got one! Fish. We got one! Odie said he we, saw an alligator. We winning! We saw an alligator! Odie said he saw a big alligator. Emma said we saw one. The one we saw was kind of small. Yeah. yeah. It was right by the landing almost. Yeah, because it was on that log and then I saw its top. Yep. So I told when it saw us, it jumped off the log into the water, didn't it? Yeah. I think this is where our fish live because it's so sad. Olivia said this is a good spot because her daddy caught a big catfish right here. I don't know. I don't know. We pull up here. Off right there, Steph. Pull it, Hopper. Pull it. Pull it, Hopper. Pick it up. Pick it up. Hi. There you go, girl. Woohoo. Woo. Give me got five, Hopper. Hopper. Give me five. That was a nice <laughs> fish. Tell everybody. Say, look at my nice fish, guys. Here, Emma. Here, here. here, Emma. This one. Oh, real. 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 Oh, man. It was getting a bite. Put it back out there. Oh, Put it back out. Put the, it, drop the button. I got to get the hook All right. out now. Let it sit right there. Okay. It was getting a bite. Here we go, Steph. She wants to hold it and show it to him. Yeah. Hold it, Harper. Hold it tight now. He'll fin you. Oh, nice fish, Harper. Good job. Good job, Harper. She oh. caught that one by herself, guys. It's Good old brim buster. That brim buster, she racked him on in. Let me put him on the stringer. Running up through that little gill again. Here we go. We're starting to get us a little mess of fish here. Yeah. All right, tighten your line up a little bit. So. All right. We got a fish. That's right, right. right there. Put it back down. Pappy it on. Put y'all in a honey hole. All right, Harper. Let's get. Oh, this. you got one. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. Oh, it oh, came out. Put it back down. Push it, no, button. just push the whoa, button. Easy, whoa, easy, whoa, easy. whoa. Oh, easy, easy, easy. Oh, it's okay. It barely poked you, Olivia. It was an accident. It was an accident. I turned the floor. Sit down right there. That's why we got to stay out of the way. It didn't, it didn't do nothing but yeah. barely touch you. Yeah, it was an accident. Yeah, it was an accident. That's why we got to be careful. We have to be really careful. We're getting a bite again, I think. Wait a minute. Put yep. it back. Put your pole back down. Mash the button so it can go to the bottom. So. It is. Click it. All right, wait a second. Let it bite it again. You got to leave it there. Olivia. All right, it's Olivia's turn to hold it, Harper. It's Olivia's turn to hold it. Let's take the pole. Is it getting a bite? Mm -hmm. Okay. There's some big fish going to be right. Put that back down. Let me see, you, Olivia. Down. Are you okay? Yeah, she's okay. She got lucky, guys. She barely got a little prick. Yeah. It Olivia. scared her, though. Hold it. <laughs> Harper, sit down right here. Sit I down. Can't. Sit down. Got some wild grape vines here. Scorpions. Ooh, Nini heard a fish jump over there. And this is the type of bank right here, guys. This is the main part of the river right here. You see the water turning right here beside us. And what it's doing is coming down around this point right here. And it's kind of doing a loop right down through here. It's actually running backwards, coming back upstream. And these fish, they sit in these spots. There's an ambush spot that they can sit here and wait on bait to come by and run out and grab them to feed. And we're in a great shaded spot, right?
Hey. Always keep a rag on board. Something to wipe your hands with. Out of that. Olivia, if you'll hang yours over, send me a little Let's bit. Let's check your bait, Emma. Let me hold it for a second. I'll, I'll put a little bit deeper for you. Okay, just um, making sure you still have some bait. I know it's not very one, deep Olivia. here, Pull but... Him up. Pull oh, him up. goodness. You got him. Oh, man, pick him up. Pick <laughs> him up, girl. Oh, that's a bass. Look at that. Woohoo! Guys, Slay, get up and get your picture with him on camera. We got to let this guy go. There is a size limit on these. All right, this is a large mile fast. Hold on, Harper. Harper, this, this is, is Olivia's. Olivia's fish. Hold it tight, Olivia, so Olivia. it won't get good. Oh. oh! Well, they got to see it on camera anyhow. <laughs> Let me see, Olivia. How does that feel? That always stinks, Man, doesn't it? Man, jumped right out of your hands, Olivia. That was a cool fish. Get me fast. Well, he's back down there, so maybe he'll bite again. You think he's still hungry? <laughs> that was a bass. <laughs> That was a it huge It might have been. <laughs> you think that was a huge bass? That means I think it was. That means All right, hand it back to the Harper this time. All right, here. Give it to Harper. Oh. That brim buster tearing them up. Here, Harper, let me get it. Put, put it back over here for you. There you go, Harper. Hold it right there. Hold it right there. These girls are having a good time, aren't one. you? I can't believe that big bass was sitting down there holding on to Olivia's. And she was about to pick it up because I was going to adjust the cork a little bit. And that guy took off. Awesome. So what is the size limit on bass now, Oliver? Um, I'm not real sure. I'm thinking at least 12 inches. I would have to check it. But yeah. you guys can check it and let us know. On the South Carolina check DNR, it. check it out for us and leave it in the comments. Then next time I'll know for these girls. They would truly appreciate it. Yeah, if we catch one that's anywhere close to size, we'll definitely check the rules for sure. We don't normally fish specifically for bass, so. But it is a big thing everywhere. Oh yeah, bass. people love bass fishing. I mean, you guys out there love bass fishing. Yeah. Harper, Olivia, put those fish back down. You can't keep pulling them out the water now. They'll die. We're trying to keep them fresh. Emma, I need you to catch a fish now. I'm done. She had okay. two bites already, but it got off both times. It's so shallow right here. Well, you know what y'all can do? Throw it right on out a little bit further. It, Here, let Nene help it you. It drops off. Jump right there on the bank, probably. Let me get it. All right, right there's good. Okay. There you go. There you All right, go. hold on. Let it, let it drop. All right, now click it one time. No, just this part. Like reel it one time so it'll click. There you go. That bass was a tough one to catch, wasn't it, Lizzie? Woohoo! They got one down here now, guys. No! No! My daddy got one. Yeah, I heard him say that. No. We're not going no. down there, Harper. Harper, we're staying did you right catch here. Did it or did Odie catch it? Odie got it. <coughs> Don't drop it. You better hold on to your reel. Reel yours up a little bit, Emma. Your line's getting too much slack in it. God bless you, Olivia. I knew that. I knew that. I knew that. Uh oh. Peppy got in a hey, good spot way over there. Get your pole up out the water. You got to keep your pole out the water. No, not your whole thing. Just your rod tip. Keep it out the water. No, let it down some. A little bit. Let it down. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> we got a tiny mess going on here. 
Put your cork back in the water, Harper. <laughs> your cork is supposed to sit on top of the water. Well, fishing ain't just about to catch you guys. <laughs> Not for this cruise. Yeah, if we catch fish today, it's purely love. It's just a miracle. Oh, my rod almost <laughs> went out the bucket. <laughs> Thank goodness for this ice water. Ice water. Ice water. Now, ice. 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 Why you want to be so mean to Pappy? No. You're not? What you call it? Being good? Yeah. yeah. I think that's a good spot to catch a fish right there. Put that, Put that right there. Y'all making too much noise. Hold it. Right there. Let Olivia hold it a little bit. Keep it over that way like that, Olivia. Mean you have a sunscreen mustache? Yeah. Now make sure y'all apply that sunscreen. It's hot out here. If you're out in the sun, that sun will burn you up. Emma, in the sun? Yep, you got sunscreen on you. I can see it in your hair line. No, am I in the sun? Are you in the sun? No, we all in the shade right now. That's why Peppy pulled over to this side so we could be in the shade a little bit. Because we were right over there in the sun. I have through over here that is bush, and I'm right under the edge. Looks like something might be. I'm not seeing it. That's probably home. You got something, Emma? I'm trying to do it. Do you have it? Is there a fish on it? Yep. No, no, I think you're, you're just hung up. You're just hung up. Hold on. There you go. You hung up like Yep, Pappy's hung up over there too. You hung back up? No, yo, there we, you got a timber bass. Look at there. All right, let's put your. Yeah. Let me see it. Yep, that's what we call a timber bass, folks. You catch a piece of stick or tree. We'll let that timber bass go back, catch and release with him. What you think? <laughs> I want one of them bass like Olivia has. Oh yeah. How about one that would eat that size? If I get one of them, that's going to make my day. Hold on, let's let it out a little bit. Right now, I get it down. Quit drumming, Harper. You have gone to, you, you're going to have spot tail bass and black drum running up here from the coast. I can't Quit doing that. Yeah, Harper hitting the boat. Harper. Stop. Let me get it she thinks Pappy's playing. Bend over. Bend over. Let me pop you with this paddle one time. But I get you. Oh, were you back on a timber bass down there? No. Probably. No. I want it with a timber bass. <laughs> Drifted around right over the top of our fishing spot. I know. I think I'm going to enjoy the spot. We figure we've made enough noise in that spot that if there was any fish there, they're gone now.
you one, Emma. Yeah. Emma's catching one right now. Really, man, Ella. Don't slow down. Don't let him go. Reeling too fast. You get your wrap around a stick. Keep reeling him. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. Reel it. You got a big one. That's got to be a big one. Keep reeling. Reel it. Reel. Don't stop. Oh, that's a big one. Real, 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 real. real. Don't, don't worry about picking him up. Just keep reeling. Look at there. Look at there. <laughs> that is a big one. Wow. Let me get the hook out. Let me get the hook. Papa, can I take a picture with it? Yes, of course. Yeah, I was going to let her hold the line. Holding with two hands, one on his tail, one on his head, like that. You gotta hold him, tight. Grab hold him tight. Hold him tight. Here you go. We're not gonna look to hold him like that. Okay. Hold on, Pepe. We got four fish. We only got three keepers. All right, there you go, Emma. Now hold him up. Oh, no. Hold him Look up. Look at me. Turn around. The camera's that way. Woohoo. So that's Emma's big one right Check there. Check out my fish, you guys. Check out my fish, you guys. Woohoo. These girls have all caught one now. Good job. All right, and that's Peppy's going to have to. Big, big one. That one swallowed the hook, so Peppy's got to get you rigged back up. Good job, Emma. Give me five. Is that a good spider or a bad spider? I think bad. A bad. You better get rid of him then. Reel it, reel it, Olivia. That's a big one now. Reel it, reel it, Olivia. Reel it. That's a big one there. Yeah. Baby, baby, yes, y'all. Let me tighten your drag a little bit. All right, reel. Pull up on it and then reel down. Like reel down this way. Reel. Now pull up. Oh, that's a big fish. Did he hang up? Hello. Let me see. Let me see. Mimi, the car. Mimi. You got hung up. Mimi. Oh, here he is. Can I go for it? He's hung up around the log. Trying to get him somewhere out there from under. Oh man, the fish is on there, but he's hung up. Man. He got wrapped around a log. Wait a minute. Oh, he came out. Come on. Uh -oh. He's he, off. Oh, he got off now. Man, we try. Yep, that's part of fishing. You'll have to come down. He wrapped you around a log. Reel it, Harper. Reel. Turn it. Keep turning. Turn it. Get it, Harper. Keep turning. He's, he's trying to run. Hold it out right now. There you go. Don't let your wrist hit. Are you okay? Really? Ooh. Oh, Lordy. Look at here. There you go. Gotcha, one. Hold it up by her, Peppy. Good job, Harper. Good job, Harper.
Another one. She's upset. That's how we all get when we lose a fish for uh, tangled her up under that log and she's upset about it. Okay. We're gonna try to catch some more to... Huh? Daniel said that him and Odie haven't had any bites back there yet, so that's two fish out of this spot and one bite that we lost. What's you coming back here for? Good job, Harper. Give me that thumbs up. Mm hmm. I'm just gonna put that one on a stringer for these girls. Do y'all like to eat fish? I love yeah. these fish. Look at that. Oh yeah, Three, got a nice little stringer five going on. Point. Four. Five. There's four fish on the stringer so far. Keep reeling. Don't stop. He'll get under that log that's down there. Just keep reeling it, Emma. Don't move reel the rod. It, Just reel it. Reel, reel, reel. He's strong. There you go. Okay, yeah. Nice. Another yeah. one in the boat. Yeah. <laughs> Got it? Another one in the boat, you guys. Good job, Emma. Good one. Oh, Olivia's hooked up again, you guys. Let's see if she can get this one in the boat. Come on, Olivia. I believe you got that one. You're keeping him up high. Mm -hmm. Oh, a nice brim. Oh, yeah. Pretty. Mm -hmm. Wow, look mm -hmm. how yellow he is. Yeah. Here, hold him and let him see. Mm -hmm. Hold him up towards the camera. I want another snack. Oh, yeah. That's a nice one. That's a beauty. Woohoo. Pretty, pretty. Mm -hmm. He's going to be easy to get the hook out of, too. Yep, it's hooked right in the corner of his mouth. All right, let me get him off of there and get you back in the water. All right. What would you say, him? I want another snack. I want more snacks. They loving these pink worms. I have back up. Emma's pulling them in. Reel it, Emma. Reel it. Reel it. Don't don't worry about the rod. Don't just worry reel about it. Pulling the rod. Just keep reeling. It's heavy. Yeah. Well, well you got to keep, keep reeling it. Turn it, turn, turn it. it turn Don't it. pull it forward. Reel it fast. Let it come back this way, son. We'll just keep reeling. Reel it, reel it. Reel, reel, reel. Reel it, reel it, reel it. All you gotta do is reel it. <coughs> oh, oh, yeah, I see it coming. Yeah, that's oh. a big one. Keep reeling, keep reeling. Reel, reel. Reel, reel. Reel it. Reel oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice one. Oh, it's You wanna hold your line, Emma, and show them? Hold it. Emma. Hold it and let them see it. Hold the line right there where he's got it. Hold it. Take it. Pick it up. Yeah, That's buddy. That's a nice one. Woohoo! Good. Is that exciting, style. Emma? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Let me hold. He was almost through with your Twizzler when he bit, wasn't you? I we eat the snacks and the fish have started. I want another one. Put a fish off of. I want another one. Mine together now look. <laughs> oh yeah, look at here. Boy, they're starting to add up now. <laughs> How's that look, girl? Yeah. Man, is, is that exciting? We got a mess of fish. Hey, I'm Daniel and Odie, and look at that. Little Odie just reeled in a big old catfish. Good job, Odie. Sit down in the boat, buddy. Don't stand up on that seat now. So how many? We, we got three that we can.
We got eight. We're going to have a fish fry this afternoon. Y'all want to have a fish fry? Yeah. Where you, where you fry fish? Yeah. Clean them and you fry them. That's what uh, my mom always told me. You know, if you catch fish, you need to clean them and eat them. What time is it now? 11.50. Uh oh. You don't want to go. I have to go to the dentist. Yep, you have a yeah, dentist appointment sure today. Is. Gotta go get your teeth cleaned. You got to go to the dentist. You ain't even got an option. You got to go. go. Alright, Emma's got to go to the dentist. Dennis. Yep, Emma and Odie both have cleaning appointments today, so good luck. Y'all be good. And y'all get a prize when you leave, right? And some shiny clean teeth. These. I hope so. No, 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 no. If we be bad, we're going to get one. We had fun, Emma. Bye, We had fun. Y'all be careful. Y'all be good. I'll see you this afternoon. All those butterflies. No, you can just wet your pants. You can get your pants wet. Oh my god. No, no. I'm sunk in. It almost sunk you. Yeah, it. The water feels good though, it's nice and cold. Oh my god, Yeah, it's kind of a mixed muddy sand bottom here. It's not really like sticky mud, but it's soft sand. Very soft. Oh, Pappy's got a bite already. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Got one already hooked up on the, off of this edge of the sandbar. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Man, that's the type that right there when you fry this little guy, when you bite him, you Mom, bite him about in half. Look, look. <laughs> Bones and all, fry him hard. Two finger fish. How big is he? He may be three fingers. He's a nice yeah, little fish. Yeah, he's three fingers. Don't be picking on my catch. Oh, no. I ain't. That's the kind my mama and I know you love the most, these Where'd little ones. Where'd you do the cooler bag? Here we go. We've transferred our fish over to a little cooler bag now. Keep them cold. Man, that was a quick bite. Yeah, like it was. It feels like poopy. It's okay. It's only on your feet. <laughs> this water's got like all kind of glitter in it. I wonder what that means. Yeah, it does look pretty. Some of you guys may know why this sand here has lots of that iridescent like glitter. And that, yeah, it's everywhere. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but 
little flecks of metallic. Not really sure what it would be, really. Poopy. <laughs> it's not poopy. Of course it's not. <laughs> Harper's loving this cold water, aren't you? Harper, don't go past the boat. Stay up this way. The current is moving this way behind us. So I'm trying to keep the kids this way so if they go to floating, you know, they don't get too far past the boat. This is a great place to make them mud pies for sure. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. I don't like this fishing spot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and then he starts throwing it back. Don't be whining. Don't worry. I got an ankle up, so I'm gonna drag y'all behind the boat for about ten minutes before y'all get in here to drag y'all. <laughs> you think it'll rinse off easy? Yeah. Oh goodness. <laughs> Alright, alright. Now you got to go out there and rinse off. Wait, what? Thankfully, it does rinse off easy. Mm -hmm. Go see that sun block. I'll leave y'all here for a while. I'll leave y'all here for a while and I'll go fish. In my whole entire life. It drops off, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah? Get Harper said, yeah. See it? <laughs> I hit some on You got to rub it with your hand. Rub it. Oh, I oh, no, I'm the one and I'm not a person. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Papa, you want to play with me in the water? Yeah. Okay, then call me. Wait, yeah, where are we all a person? It feels good. Okay. See if we can find a little bit. Sandier sand ball. So we see some of the birds, the kites, a bunch of them circling right here. They're skimming down over the water.
the big fireplace or on the front porch big stone fireplace lots of little river houses through here camper set up sheds guys oyster cells all along the bank here this is a tall steep bank and from what I understand it is actually not lawful to take these oyster shells out of this bank either or to mess with them do you see the size of some of them there there's some there 10 to 12 inches Yep, you can see the water is kind of shallow right here beside the bank. Under the water, I mean. But yeah, some of those right there, I mean, those shells are huge. Uh-oh. And they're all along these banks. We've already been passing them for quite a ways that way. And you can see it's, they're all in the bank. So this direction too. So, what's your guys' explanation for oyster shells being in the bank of a freshwater river 100 miles inland? Another alligator. This is number nine. He's right there. Right up on the bank there. Mutter made oh, some ramble. Scared. Yep. He's just a little fella. Still plenty big enough to do plenty of damage. But gator number nine. He's probably what a three and a half, four footer. Something like that. Might have been a little bigger. What if they eat the duckies? Sometimes that probably does happen. That's nature. These little skiffs, these Carolina skiffs that they got moored or anchored out in the river, uh, they're little check stations where they do tests on water samples in the Savannah River.
and it's the same sandbar. Girls! Girls! We're here! Do you want to swim? Are you ready to swim? Yeah? Woke up ready to swim. I guess someone left a grill up here to cook out with. Community grill. Bring it to me. What'd y'all find? Let's see. Fresh water little clams. Cool. Awesome. So you can see the main section of the river comes from this way and it's making a hard bend to the left, turn to the left. And that's what's creating this sandbar here we're on. Nice little place to come. Bring the family, hang out a little bit. Enjoy a little time out on the water. That's what it's all about, right? The water's nice and clear. <laughs> that water's cold. Like an Alright, y'all don't get out there too far. Yeah, and it drops off right over there. Does it feel good, Harper? You see all those little minnows? Yeah. I know that. You know that? Yeah. How did you know? You've been here before? Yeah. Okay. Your daddy brought you. Okay. We're going to swim a little bit. Look at this, Steph. Something was on this reel. Guys, I had no idea. Come here, Olivia. This is a big one. Here, get it. Hold it, now hold, it hold it right here. Hold it, reel it. 
I had no idea this guy was on here. Yeah. Reel it, Livy. I think you got a catfish. No, don't back up. Just reel. Don't go way up up the bank. Okay. Yeah, come back down some. Reel back down. Dum, 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 dum. Oh, yeah. This is going to be a good one for the fish fry. Oh, man. Pull him on up. Look up there. The biggest fish of the day. Catfish. What you think about that one, Steph? Man, man, man. You talking about some good fr fried fish nuggets right here, these catfish? Perfect size. Probably, what, a two pounder? All right, no, don't touch it, don't touch it. I just don't want you to get thinned. Uh-oh. He popped it. He popped it, yep. Did he pop it? it? No, the hook come out. Just put the line down so it don't get tangled up. Lay the reel down for me. Okay. All right, you can pick him up. Watch his fins now. There you go. Big catfish for Olivia. That's your biggest fish ever, isn't it, Olivia? He is a giant. Wow. That's awesome. I'm glad I threw that little rod out. I was coming back to rebate it when I set the camera down and turned it on, on the front of the boat for you guys and went to reel it up, and bam, he was there. All right, Harper. Yep. Harper was holding it. Let me get him rinsed off for him, Steph. Let me rinse him off, Olivia. Mm -hmm. I'm not really sure what this is. I found something. Got a lot of grooves in it. Reminds me of different types of teeth, but I'm not sure any of you guys that know, let me know. It is really hard, like a tooth. This is a really good one. No way. Oh, hold on. You got the line tangled around you, Harper. Don't get hooked. Is, that hook's uh, still on it. Pretty sure that's what they call the channel cat. Yeah. A channel cat. Nice. I don't know. Very cool. Hey, Olivia it. wants to hold it now that it's clean. Hey, come back up here. Hey, hey. hey Both of you can't hold it at the same time. All right, look at me, Olivia. There you go, girl. Good job. That's nice. A, that's her first big catfish. He's a giant boy. Okay? He is a giant. <laughs> Let me see, Harper. Would you hold in that giant boy? Yeah. <laughs> that, that was worth the coming for. Woohoo! Huh? All right, Pappy's yep. going to have to put him in the cooler. Well, it was worth making the trip right there, guys. Let's put him in the boat. Wait a minute. He's still got some sand on him. Don't get out of water. Yeah, in case he gets all, get out of your hand. Remember that bass that slipped out of your hand earlier and how upset sure. you were? Put him down in the cooler. Yep, put him in there with the ice. Oh, need to put some more ice on him. I'm going to put some more ice on him. How's that feel? That's good. <laughs> Does that make up for that little bass that slipped out of your hand earlier today? Yeah, because he was just a tiny one. That's right, he was a tiny one. We were going to have to let him go anyway, but yeah. you were just upset because you didn't even get your picture with him, did you? I know, I yep. She's all good now. So Plenty of ice blocks Me? that we just froze in plastic cups last night. She said, what'd you say, Olivia? I feel amazing. <laughs> you feel amazing? She was saying she was so excited. She was so excited. Sunny D. 100% vitamin C, it says. We're getting plenty of vitamin C and plenty of vitamin D. We need I hope it. we catch another one. That's right, Pappy's going to have to get set back out so you guys can try to catch out. another. I might set both of them reels out now. Yeah. And these fish, they're not going to go to waste. Oh no, we're going to eat them. Who else on watching loves fried fish? If you love fried fish, leave us a comment. Let us know you love some fish. We love some fish. Y'all know we like seafood in general, so. Caught him on the little pink worm. There's a good one. Go down, big pink worm, and bring us up another catfish. And, and this, the, what surprises me, he had to be right here in this shallow area. 
the sandbar, I can see it, you know, the sandbar out eight or ten foot or so at least out here. And it's sloping a lot here because of the bend in the curve. So catfish ain't always in the deep holes. We're gonna put this reel where it don't get pulled out. Olivia said, I have to come here and see this, and I see something bubbling there. <laughs> mermaid thing. Mermaid you talk. Oh, the minnows? I doubt you, you guys can't see that, but we can see lots of minnows swimming here. Yes. You remember how the motor, every time that we was idling and I would put it in forward, it would shut off with us. These little carburetor motors right here, they got a, this right here is, um, controls the fuel that idles it up and down. And then you got a little screw right back in here that controls the airflow to the carburetor. So I'm trying to get it adjusted so that when I put it in gear at an idle, it don't shut off. So. So this is idled all the way down now. Don't worry about that smoke. Two stroke motors are gonna do that because you mix the two cycle all the way. So when we was shifting in the forward, it was shutting off. Hopefully it don't now. That's in forward. And it's pushing the boat right up against the bank so it has a little bit more pressure on it even than normal. And like I'm saying, like if I wanted to idle this motor up right now, this screw right here, turn it clockwise, idles it up, counterclockwise, sets it back down. I'm thinking that's pretty close right there. That's about what I want. When you got old motors and stuff, you need to know how to work on them. So maybe that'll help some of you guys out if you start having problems like that. We're about to head out. No more bites right here. And our day at the sandbar is over. We're going to head on back. Y'all girls ready for the ride back? Yeah. Y'all going to spot some turtles and alligators and birds and things like that? Sleep. Are y'all going to go to sleep? Yeah. You're not going to go to sleep? Huh? No. <laughs> you? Let me see what you got. Are you playing with your nail? One of those little clam shells. Mine. Did you girls have a fun day? Yeah. I love that big old catfish you called Olivia. How about them big brim you pulled in, Harper? Yep. Was that fun? Y'all been pretty good today. I think we might have to go home and cook for y'all tonight. What you think? You want me to do the cooking tonight, Steph, or are you going to do it? Uh, if you're willing to, I'll let you do it. <laughs> you hungry. Imagine that. They're hungry again. Oh, well. A man got to do what a man's got to do. If I need to cook, I'll do it. You want me to clean the fish, too, or are you going to clean the fish? Either way, I can clean them or you can clean them. I'll let you clean the fish. Alright. How about you, Olivia? You help clean them fish? How many fish do we end up with total? I'm surprised we even caught any fish with these bananas on the boat. Today. I'm thinking we had nine brim and the one catfish. I think it's ten total. So we right. lost a couple bites and the bass that got away. And then we had one bass. Or the bass that jumped out of Olivia's hand. And it was too small to keep. We wouldn't keep right. it anyway. And Daniel and them, they have some more fish. You want a piece, Olivia? Yeah. 
I just seen a look like a sturgeon jumped up out of the water over there, guys. There are sturgeon and big garfish and stuff in the Savannah River, so very possible. We're gonna head on out. Let me see if I can get it from back up, Steph. Fire back up. But I am definitely surprised with these bananas on the boat today that we caught any fish, so because it is a fisherman superstition. No bananas on the boat. Oliver packed a bag this morning. He was up at four o'clock anticipating today's trip. We were gonna Oliver's leave at always eight. got bananas on the boat. <laughs> you mean these bananas? Yeah. <laughs> Pappy's bananas? Yeah, I'm a little bananas anyhow. <laughs> Boat's doing good. Forward. That idle. Still running. Got a little shake to it. Maybe we don't have the oil fuel ratio quite right. But um, a lot better than it was doing. I'm happy with it. It got us up the river today, right? Yep. As long as it gets us back, it'll be good. Look at here, Olivia. I see a turtle on that log right. Oh, it just went in as soon as I said that. Let's get out of here. <laughs>